The Harry Potter series is full of rich elements. Magic, adventure, darkness, friendship, excitement. But where's all the romance? Hogwarts is a school full of teenagers, and crushes in dating and love do not elude them. Well, yes, it is touched upon a few times. The events surrounding the Yule Ball and Goblet of Fire definitely springs to mind. For the most part, the series was largely free of romantic drama, at least when compared to what we got on the page. Take Harry and Ginny's relationship, for example. In the books, it was a lot more passionate, and while the author does refrain from outright describing what they do, it is alluded to that they constantly are sneaking off to hidden alcoves in the school, making out whenever they get the chance, and, you know, having picnics by the Black Lake. Movie Harry and Ginny? Some flirty glances and meat kisses. The most passionate they get is some hand-holding at one point. And it's not just their relationship that's suffered in the transition to the big screen. Remus and Tonks, as well as Bill and Fleur relationships, get passing mentions, and that's about it. Ron and Hermione's relationship also took a bit of a hit, though that is more down to the way in which Ron was presented to the audience, filling much more of a comedy relief role than being a fully fleshed-out character as he was on the page. As such, a lot of audience members had trouble buying his relationship with Hermione, as it was hard to see what she really saw in him. I get that things need to be cut to keep a film adaptation to a reasonable length, but this is one element that was removed or reworked that kind of just made the film versions worse. 